Bodybuilding representing half of MB33, and today I have another keto dieting video. It kind of goes along with the last one, except for the last one was about carbs, and this one is about fiber, which sounds really boring, kind of like the 5x5 five five method, Matthew. You're telling me. But it's actually really essential and helpful when you're dieting. And let me explain why. I'll give you another real life example, just like the last video. I was making my lunch for tomorrow, and I noticed when I looked at the nutrition on the back of these spinach flour tortilla wraps it has 14 grams of carbs and 9 grams of fiber now you always hear when you're losing weight that fiber is important and this is really the reason why is because if you didn't know this it cancels out carbohydrates and what that means is I'll take this example 14 carbs is what's in the total tortilla 9 grams of fiber is what it takes away so it'd be 14 minus 5 and then a little bit easier way to explain this would be let's say the gross amount of carbs in the tortillas not that they taste gross but spinach does but it's 14 kind of like your pay at the end of the week you get a total amount without taxes now imagine the taxes that get taken away from your paycheck as the fiber that takes away carbs and then the net is the total that's left over so you take 14 carbs, which is what's in there, and then the fiber, which is 9, and take 14 minus 9, and it's 5 net carbs. So really, you're only eating 5 carbs out of this thing when it tastes like you're eating 14, because 5 is all you consume, which is really awesome, and it's another way to keep you full, which goes along with the last video, but that's not what this is about. It really, if you don't count fiber, well, you can count it to see how much you get, but if you don't take that away from your carbs that you're eating, it takes away even more calories without you realizing it, which is what I do. I try to aim for about 40 uh, grams of fiber if I can a day, and so it takes 40 carbs away, and I don't even notice it. So it's really great, and it helps you a lot. So even though Fiber One bars are pretty crappy for you, they taste really good. They taste like candy bars. So I'd eat some of those maybe. Anyway, hope you guys like this video. Speaking of that, you can actually like this video, throw it on a comment, and even subscribe. Remember guys, there's always more on the way, so stay tuned. Using straps, like these Versa grips, like helping you grab on the bar, or any other kind of standard strap, versus chalk, and I mean any kind of chalk, like little- I know.